Today I was going to do a full day in the life vlog, a nice fun one. Um, full doctor. Yeah, but change of plans. We just got to the doctor. We actually got here right on time. And I was going to take Ava to the doctor. And then Peter's in the back there too because his school nurse called and said I he was... Peter too. You love him? Yeah. Said he was sick. So this is just going to be a real life. I want to get them both tested for strep. So we're going to head in to the doctor now and you're just going to get the reality of being a mom. I mean, I feel like my whole channel is that. So we're going to go now. You okay, honey? Mm -hmm. You want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> He's yeah. a champ. You want to say hi? Yeah. Okay, say hi. <laughs> so we just left the doctor. Ava, <laughs> you're waving. We just left the doctor. Turns out Peter tested positive for strep. So I thought it was going to be the other way around. I was like, it's going on Ava's daycare. Ava's going to have it. And of course, they tested both of them. And Peter tested positive, but the doctor said Ava's throat looked worse. And like, she's showing all the signs. And most likely, she it's a rapid, it was a rapid test. So most likely, what did they say, Peter? Most likely on the cultural test, yeah. it might. Um, so they're going to treat them both for strep. So I'm like, thank God I took them both. And got him checked because with strep you need to be put on antibiotics and all that. So this is where the day's gone. We're gonna take them, get the medicine, get them lots of fluids. I remember when I was little, I had strep and I couldn't even get off the couch. Yeah, strep and is bad. Every morning I had like toast with jelly and I watched Ghostbusters. <laughs> strep is rough because your whole body aches when you have strep. It's like the flu. But yeah, I yeah. feel like people like don't realize and I don't know if I filmed any of it I don't think I filmed. I think I filmed right after but last week I was so sick for like two days I couldn't get off the couch like I was just laying there. I was so sick I took a two-hour nap the one day like and then the third day I was still feeling a little rough But I kept saying to Peter. I'm like don't drink out of any of my drinks Don't eat anything I'm eating because I my throat is killing me but she said, because I was like, I don't, usually you need antibiotics for strep. So I was just like, I don't know if that's what I had. But again, it's just going around here where we live in New Jersey, like, or in New Jersey, I guess, like crazy. I don't know if other states, but now we're going to go home. Luckily with kids, I feel like once you guys get medicine, they'll be like in them. And so I'm like, I'll give you some Tylenol when we get home, Peter. Remember when I had the flu for a week and I couldn't even, like I had to go to the bathroom every day but like i couldn't even move and it hurt to walk yeah that, that was bad that that was really bad peter got the flu it was when i was pregnant with ava yeah and i had it for like a whole week yeah that was really bad i was yeah. literally 38 was weeks pregnant. pregnant um 38 or 39 but weeks pregnant peter had the flu and so he didn't come to the hospital when i had ava because i ended up going to labor early <laughs> so yeah that was bad all right, let's go home. Okay, we just got home. We stopped and got Wendy's on the way because you know, that's what you do when a kid's sick. You get them Wendy's. Here, let me see. What do we get? I got a crispy chicken sandwich and Ava got chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets. We're gonna set up on the couch with the trays. Um, the whole the whole nine yard. Dave was just like, yeah, I think I'm gonna stay at my mom's. And I'm like, no, you're not tapping out. Like, you gotta help me here. So he's gonna come home, but. They seem, you know, they seem fine. fine. Yeah. Except for a little nausea. Yeah. Once you get the antibiotics, she'll be good. Yeah. All right, let's get this set up. Hey. I have to make sure they're not poisonous. That's what mom said. You say yeah. that every time. Dave just came home to sit with the kids. I'm gonna go pick up their medicine and all of that. I have a feeling a lot better anxiety wise. I just have like some highs and lows sometimes. And like even now with the kids getting sick it's hard because as a mom like I forget when it like stopped being like okay you're a mom like that's what you do like I don't know why that stopped being so important where it's always like well what else do you do what's your job like you know taking care of the kids is a lot so I get like overwhelmed like I always feel like like even now with the kids being sick 
I feel like I'm not doing enough when we're in reality like just caring for them should be enough I don't know if anyone can relate to this but like it gets so hard because I'm always like all right I should be doing more instead of just sitting on the couch snuggling my kids when like that's what they need from me so it's it's just hard like I just wanted to say that but I'm like I obviously I love being a mom I feel like that goes without saying like you guys can see it like I'm obsessed with my kids and Ava is like my partner in crime but yeah it's just you know this mom guilt stuff that goes on in our head so I'm gonna focus on just taking care of them we're honestly not gonna do much today I don't know how much I have to show so I think I'm gonna do a couple days in the life vlog I know I have a home chef order I'm getting a code with them but I don't know if I'll have it yet. So if I do have it, I'll pop it up on the screen for you guys or I'll put it in the description box. But I'm so relieved I ordered and it like came today because I'm like, there was no way I was cooking. So we'll just have a fun little hangout day. Look what Peter just put on. What a throwback for all the 90s kids, 80s babies, 90s kids, you know this one. So I'm gonna start making dinner. I'm gonna do this one pot sausage risotto. I do have a code for Home Chef. It's JanieFam18, which by the time this video will, goes up, it will be active, and that gets you 18 free meals um, when you sign up, so it's really good. But yeah, I'm gonna do this one. The one pot sausage risotto and I'm gonna get that started for dinner. Four cups of water to a boil. calories 20 grams of protein I'm whispering because I know the kids are in here so good they're legendary food I got it from Amazon so good but let me show you dinner it smells amazing that's what it looks like now it smells so good we're gonna let it cool but I just wanted to make it early um because the kids always get hungry so early I meant to show you because I like tried to make it so pretty this one I will 100% get again it is so good. You what? You want some? No. You just want some mash. Come here. You want some dinner? No. What can I get you? No. You don't have to eat dinner, Beam. Don't judge me. I'm not arguing. She's not feeling good. So if she doesn't want to eat dinner, she doesn't have to tonight. We decided since it's beautiful out, we're going to have dinner. Yeah, dinner. Out here, right? <laughs> and get some sunshine. Sunshine. Make us feel all better. Yeah. I don't know. This little girl went to bed at 6 p.m. last night and woke up at like 7.30 a.m. today. That's like and over. And I feel much better. Yeah, right? We had a good night's rest. We're going to stay home and rest again today so we could be all better. Peter's upstairs doing whatever boys do. So I came upstairs just to get dressed really fast. Peter's downstairs with Ava. They both seem like so much better today. I could tell by Ava's, Peter seems really good actually, but I could tell by Ava's eyes that they're like still a little glossy. So she's definitely not 100% as much as she wants to like run around. So I'm sorry this vlog turned into me <laughs> taking care of the kids, but 
That's just what it is. Is this tangled in the back? No. Um, another day, another free people hotshot onesie. I love these things. I wish. For, I mean, I feel like that's so many girls' dreams to work with free people, but they have such cute stuff. So I was going to actually, I just got ready really fast, and I was like, maybe I should do something cute with my hair. Like, I put a braid in Ava's. But I also don't have time. Dave's bringing them home for breakfast right now. So I don't know if I have time to play around with my hair. But like I've been seeing, and I feel like I like them on other girls, but not on me. And it, they're also younger than me. So maybe that's why, where they do like the two braids in the front. And maybe it sounds ugly, but it looks so cute. If you know what I'm talking about, like just comment below. But I don't know. Like I don't know if that would look good on me because I also love having these front pieces. The dilemma. <laughs> Got one sick kid and the other one. Okay, since Dave missed breakfast, he bought lunch. Look at this sub. I'm gonna cut it for you, okay? You eating like a big girl? Good job. Oh. Let, Let me see you take this. another bite. Then press best practices. Good morning. <laughs> We're gonna get dressed and go outside and go on a little splash pool. Uh, yeah, and I got water for that. I got that. I can put water in it if I got it. So bye. <laughs> We're about to go outside and go in the pool for a little bit. Peter's outside filling up the pool right now for Ava. It's like a little splash pool. But I mentioned the pre-workout I was using the other day. And I feel like I didn't even show you guys. Ava, are you naked? She's naked. Yeah. You will quit. I have her swimsuit right here. Anyway. Um... Sorry if it's loud because that's the pool, but this is the pre-workout that I was using. It's Astro Flav, and I love it. And they just recently gave me a code, which is Janie, and that gets you 10% off. Love their protein. Um, what have I used? Their protein, I use their woman's hormonal balance. It's almost like Alani New Balance. I feel like those are similar if you're trying to compare it. Cine Crunch Protein's amazing. We have a couple of their products. We were used to use them all the time, and then they changed the packaging, and I almost forgot about them. But when they fi figured out that they changed it, I was like, oh, yes. So I'm really happy they gave me a coat. But now I'm going to put Ava's bathing suit on and we're going to hang out outside. Cool. Ava, show everyone your bathing suit. Show everyone your bathing suit. <laughs> it's, it's so pretty and it's blue like who? Elsa. Elsa. Oh, we were trying to film uh, questions because those seem to do well and you guys seem to like it. But... There's a gremlin here. Who's the gremlin? Me. <laughs> I'm the gremlin. You're the gremlin. I'm the swing. Get your feet off the counter. Her feet are clean. Are they clean? Yeah. They're clean. I got my feet on my head. <laughs> I got my food on the table. I love that she talks in accents. I got my food on the table. I got my food on the table. Thank you. I'm making you mac and cheese. I got my food. Hey, you feet warm. Stop pulling her feet. <laughs> We're going to do questions with Eva. If you could be any animal, what animal would you be? Um, a cat. A cat? A cow. A cow. A cow? I don't know. 
What do cows do? Moo. Dad, if you could be any animal, what animal would you be? I don't know. A dog. A dog. A dog. I used to want to be a princess. You want to be a princess? I used to want to be a princess too. No, you're a boy. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Dad. <coughs> Sorry. No princess for me. <laughs> if you could be any movie character, which one would you be? John Wick. John Wick. What the heck is that? What the heck is that? Is it Zach? Zachary. Go get the... It's Zach Pat. Good afternoon. Sorry, we're in my car, and if it's loud, I have the air conditioning like pumping because it is so hot out. It's literally 90 degrees right now. I don't know where that came from, and it's been warm the last couple of days, but I swear it was like it goes from in New Jersey from like 40 degrees to 80 degrees, like that. It's just the weather's all over the place, but. I know this vlog has been all over the place because the kids got sick and that was like my main focus obviously like reality of mom life and just doing what you gotta do but right now I am actually on my way to a therapy appointment I mentioned in a couple of videos that I, did I actually take my medicine today? I don't remember that I started um, that I've been struggling with anxiety and I've been looking for a therapist and I finally found one that I really like. I met with one other and I didn't really like, I don't know, I didn't feel like comfortable. And then I met with this lady and I was like, oh my gosh, like, I love you, but I had to wait for her to get openings. So I really like her. So I'm on my way to meet with her. And you know, like, I just always think like, I'm a big therapy fan. Sorry if you could see me sweating because I'm literally sweating right now. I cannot figure out how to do my air conditioning all over the place but I do have a couple of like really fun things that I plan on filming like I'm gonna do my May favorites I was gonna film that today but the day just got away with me in all honesty and with the kids being sick I'm like whatever but I'm gonna do that next week I'm gonna film some May favorites and then I also want to film like a sit down me and Dave tried to do you saw it in this video of questions and answers so just like a fun lighthearted video with Dave like everyone always likes to see him and then um I'm gonna vlog all weekend so like once I end this video I'm just gonna go straight into a vlog and I got some good packages at home so we'll just vlog all weekend long and it will be a good one I promise we're back on the ball back on the vlogging game so I'm gonna end this off here and I hope you have a great weekend I think you'll see this after Mother's Day so if you do I hope you have the best Mother's Day and I will see you guys in the next video